Top Fuel continues here at the Lucas Oil Nationals with the Patron XO Cafe upset. Antron Brown in his 300th race day start. Third in Mike Dunn's power rankings. Clinched into the countdown, but look out for J.R. Todd. I think J.R. Todd has a shot at, and I think the conditions being cooler even makes those chances better. It's not going to be easy, though. Nope, not going to happen. 380 with a four. Maybe Antron was there to be pulled down, but Don says my car goes A to B. Donnie, sorry, you guys have to bow out early today. Well, Connie and the team brought out this new car for J.R. Todd, and they've really struggled with it this week. It doesn't mean it isn't going to work. It just means it's a little bit different from what they've been running. You saw they got bit by that tire shake. The car just doesn't get enough wheel speed out there, rattled the tires. J.R. got out of it when he felt it, but when your competition's not having any problems, all you can do is watch. Thought perhaps it was a chance. J.R. Todd's fifth start from 16th. One time he took out the number one qualifier. Thought it could have happened there again, but it didn't. Current top fuel standings will find that the top six racers are clinched into the countdown to the championship. Doug Coletta down through Spencer Massey. The battle, though, Mike's going to be for that number one spot. Yeah, and you take a look at seven, eight, nine, and ten have already exited the, today. Well, with, with number one qualifier, Jamie Howe caught up with Doug just a moment ago.